I'm brought up to believe that we all have different inspirations, but to one goal, better world. Good afternoon, I'm Ngong Palin Jamsul studying in Kangkong Middle Secondary School and I'm so delighted to welcome you all. What a beautiful day it is and I'm so happy to be sharing it with you. Well, do you remember the first line I said? We all have different inspirations, but one goal, better world. Now, if we ask ourselves, how can we make our world a better place, then for me, a better place is when there are better people. Andrew Jackson once said, Every good citizen makes his country's honor his own and cherishes it not as precious but as sacred and is willing to risk his life in his defense and is conscious that he gains protection while he gives it. Well said. Are you a good citizen? A citizen of the world is someone who understands that the world needs more love. There's so much negativity out there. There are wars, there are corruption, there are violences, and a lot more stuff that gets me scared sometimes. But I'm a good citizen and I want to do all that I can to make my world a better place to live and to love my country and to see what I can do to make my country the best country it can be. I want to help the poor and I want everyone to live happily and in harmony. Let's talk about citizens. Citizens are people living in a country and that belongs to a community. Um, some skills and attributes of good citizens are they think critically, they analyze information, they negotiate and compromise, they resolve conflicts and participate in community events. Now I'm so excited to share with you 10 ways to become good citizens. Number one, Volunteer. Volunteer to be active in your community, do some social work, help others, and make a difference. Number two, be honest and trustworthy. You don't have to be perfect, just be honest and trustworthy. And never forget to keep your promises because trust is a fragile thing. Easy to lose, easy to break, but one of the hardest things to ever get back. Number three, follow rules and laws. We follow rules and laws to keep ourselves and others safe. Um, laws are to be followed by people in the community. So, obey laws and participate in decision-making processions. Number four, respect the rights of others. You give respect, you earn respect. And you gotta understand that respecting the rights of others means peace around you. Number five, be informed about the world around you. Knowing what's happening around you will keep you more aware, wiser, and can take appropriate decisions. Number six, respect the, respect the properties of others. As respect is a two-way street, you have to take care and respect the things and those belongings even if it, even if it is not yours. Because that shows who you are, your values, and your identity. Number seven, be compassionate and kind. Being compassionate and kind gives you the ability to understand someone else's situation and the desires to take actions to change their lives. And research also shows that kind and compassionate people are more satisfied in their lives, have better physical and mental health, and are having more stronger relationships. Being nice helps Others and yourself feel good too. Number nine, number eight, take responsibilities of your eight actions. The more you're willing to accept the responsibilities of your actions, the more credibility you will get. And remember that responsibilities lead to success. Number nine, be a good neighbor. Getting to know your neighbors come with a wide range of benefits with enhanced safety. Whether you need to borrow an egg or need a shoulder to cry on, um, good neighbor is always there to protect you and to be by your side in both challenging and joyous moments. This relationship will remind you that you are surrounded by friendship and support. <clears throat> Number 10, protect your environment. A nation who protects its a nation who destroys its soil destroys itself. Forests are the lungs of the land 
It purifies the air and gives fresh strength to our people. Earth provides enough to satisfy every man's need, but not every man's grid. So, in brief, a citizen should have a good knowledge and understanding about the rules and laws, the voting, the voting, voting government offices, about the role and influence of the media, human rights, cultural diversity, concepts like democracy, justice, freedom, equality, authority, and rules of the laws. So that's, ladies and gentlemen, what I, what I wanted to share with you. And remember, sometimes miracles are just good people. Just be good to yourself and to those around you. Never doubt that a small group of thoughtful and committed citizens can change the world. And trust me, you will love the amazing gift of committing to be a good citizen. Take care and stay safe.